Check it. What is up guys, welcome to another video and today we are back on Burnout and today we're on Burnout Paradise, possibly the best Burnout game ever made. So you guys heard me loud and clear, this is easily my favourite Burnout game. I absolutely adore Paradise, I played so many hours of it, easily played the most hours of it compared to all the other games. Um, you know, it got to the point where I had the Elite license, which was like the Black license, which you got for completing all the events around uh, Paradise. And I also had all the road rules, I played a hell of a lot of Paradise, I absolutely adored this game. Now, uh, sadly, uh, I actually got a yellow light of death, which is kind of the equivalent to the red ring on the Xbox back in the day. And I actually lost that save. Like, I lost all of the save. I pretty much platinumed it. I think I was a few trophies away from platinuming the game. And I lost my save. And I was absolutely gutted when it actually happened. Fuck. So that's why this save is kind of dry. I haven't really got many cars from the main game on this save, but I've got I've pretty much got all of the toy cars from Big Surf Island. I've been kind of just progressively making my way through that because I can't really be asked to go through the full game again, but I don't mind playing Big Surf Island. That's fine. Um, so what we're going to go ahead and do today is we're going to go ahead and start a stunt run and see if we can get like above a million and see how high we can really go. Now we are going to do it in this toy um, 88 special. That is what the car's called. Obviously, it's the it's the um, Back to the Future DeLorean. That is what it's based off. Um, and it's a very good car, as you can see. Before I crashed, I had like six barrel rolls going. It's going to be very, very hard to see if I can keep this going with this car. Because the toy cars are a hell of a lot harder to handle, but a lot more rewarding if you do so. So we're going to go ahead and start this stunt run, and we're going to see if we can get some absolutely insane score. Now, it says we need to get 26k. I'm telling you, without a doubt, we're going to hit 26k. Uh, I think a million is the absolute least I will accept, especially considering we've got Big Surf Island unlocked, which we will talk about a bit later, because we are going to go there. Um, I actually don't mind doing a Big Surf Island um, series if you guys want to see that, because I'm currently playing through it anyway. So if you guys do want to see something Big Surf Island related, I don't mind restarting my save and we can go ahead and do that. But anyway, let's go ahead and get more to the target at hand. Um, we're currently coming up to the quarry area. Now the quarry area was one of the best areas to explore in the original map. So we're going to see if we can get one go in. Cock. <laughs> right, so fuck this car. I didn't realise how hard this car was actually going to be to use. So we're going to go ahead and switch it out for the dust storm, which is like the buggy thing. Um, so I think there is a, uh, a safe house around here. At least that, this is where I remember it being. So I'm going to see if I can navigate my way there and we'll change car and we'll give that stunt run another go. Right, so here we go. So we've currently, we're currently in the Big Surf Island uh, cars. There's nine cars you got with the expansion. So it was a lot back in the day, especially considering that you know DLCs like this weren't really uh, uh, an, a, a, a thing that happened quite often. It was quite rare. It was quite a rare occurrence. Um, but I might as well show you the rest of the cars. So we've got the cop cars. Um, these are all DLC packs, which I obviously don't have at the moment because I need to either download them or I just don't own them. And um, the cops DLC essentially gave you. Uh, all of the cop car, all the normal cars, but in cop form, um, and that came with the cops and robbers DLC, I believe. And there were some really nice cars in there. Um, so once that drops, we'll press circle. And then if we go into uh, the boost special cars, these are some really interesting ones. Um, I remembered that for this one, you could actually switch what boost type you wanted. There's three boost types in Paradise. Um, it's Aggress ag aggression, stun, and speed, I think. And you could actually switch it between those two. And I actually had that DLC pack, so I'm definitely going to have to download that again. And then this Extreme Hot Rod was just fucking rapid. It, like, it was so fast. I remember playing with it. Um, if we go into the Legendary Cars, it's basically a bigger size version of the toy Legendary Cars that you got with Paradise. Um, or with um, Big Surf Island, even. And as you can see, it's just all the same cars, which I you probably already saw earlier on. Uh, so if you go ahead and press circle on that. And then you've got toy cars, which are the normal cars, but in toy form. Um, so kind of similar to what I've already shown you. And that was pretty goddamn cool. Uh, and then there's also bikes, and there's also normal cars. And bikes really did change the game in Paradise, not going to lie. But we're not going to go through those. We're just going to go ahead and get straight into this Dust Storm Turbo. And uh, get straight back into that stunt run. 
Okay, we're gonna have a change of plan. We're gonna go straight to Big Surf Island. Fuck any of that quarry business. We're gonna go straight there and see if we can rack up some big score. Now, I don't know what's going on with me today. I'm usually better than this, so I'm just gonna blame it on I'm having a bad day. I remember having so much fun on this game back in the day. Um, I remember they used to have a YouTube series, Criterion did, called Crash TV. And essentially there, they would give updates on the game, they'd talk about the new like patches that would come up and all that kind of stuff. It was just fun. Uh, you know, Craig Sullivan was on it back in the day, as well as like pretty much anyone who worked at Criterion and, you know, wasn't afraid of putting their like their, their face on the internet would have done it really. And it was just amazing. Like the, 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 the community around Burnout Paradise was genuinely one which was really friendly. I remember going into like a, into uh, open lobbies and I remember just like just ramming everyone and everyone loved it. It was just it was a bunch of fun and everyone like everyone got along with each other. It was it was it, this is the type of game where if you smash into someone you're not going to get mad and that really really helps because <laughs> if you do that on Need for Speed you're going to get fucked but or, or like Midnight Club or Forza. But for this like it's fun. It's Burnout really personified that community feel in every aspect of the word, whether it's down to party play or the, the actual game itself and the way it's everything's integrated with the, the free burn challenges. That, that's the reason why it's my favourite. Yeah, this game is so well made and I can appreciate Burnout 3, Burnout 2 and Burnout 1 for what they did back in its heyday. But if you're looking at it from a game standpoint, no game in the Burnout series has quite come to this level of just perfection in my opinion. Okay, so we are now in Big Surf Island as you can quite clearly see. And like I said, this area is fucking awesome. One of the best DLC areas ever in a game. And now we're going to go ahead and hoon around here and see if we can rack up some mega points. Now, I think we're going to go ahead and attempt to go for that spiral bridge. We're going to go to the top of that spiral bridge and we're going to see if we can get a flat spin um a barrel roll flat spin on the go. I think that's probably the best idea right now. So, we're... No! No, 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 no! I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose my multiplier! Go, 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 go! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I shit myself then. I thought I was gonna lose my multiplier. So now, we're gonna go ahead and drift to the top. Now, it's just important we keep the drift going so the multiplier keeps going. I don't want to use too much NOS because if we do, um, it's gonna be a bit hard to keep the combo going when we're on a straight line sort of thing. And um, as you can tell, this thing is really, really tall. And when we get to the top, we're going to get some absolutely insane air. So here we are. I think there is... I swear that there's a super jump somewhere here. Is it that one? Is that one? Which one is it? It's that one. Okay. Okay, okay. So we're going to go ahead and align ourselves to the super jump. And we're going to see if we can... Okay. Wasn't quite a barrel roll. Oh, it was a barrel roll. Okay. Okay, that's cool. I didn't think that was quite a barrel roll, but the game's given it me, so that's fine. Now, we need to make sure that we maintain it. It's really hard trying to concentrate and play this game at the same time, because everything is so fast-paced. Okay, I see a billboard, so we're going to go ahead and just go straight for that billboard. Try to get a flat spin in there. Beautiful, we've landed that perfectly. We get another flat spin in. We might be able to get a barrel roll here, actually. Nope, I just jumped really, really high. <laughs> right, we might be able to get another flat spin here. We might get done for repetition. No, it's, it's giving it us. Oh, it was a re reverse spin. That was why. All right, jumped through here. I don't really know where to go next. I, like, I usually, when, when you play Burnout and you kind of play it for long enough, you learn, like, routes you used to take. I can't remember any of the routes I used to take. So I'm kind of just freeballing this right now. I haven't really got anywhere in, in my head. I'm just kind of going with the flow of things. All right, I think I know an area where, if, where we can go to. No, that ruined my combo. I had a place to go to as well. Did, please tell me at least we got a million. Please, oh, we got two million. Fuck, we absolutely murked that one. 2.3 million. Okay, I'm happy with that. I can take that. Anyway, that's been it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to go ahead, hit the like, subscribe. If you want to see more Burnout Paradise again, let me know down in the comment section down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. You guys have been awesome. Stay safe and peace.